What's going on, fam? It's the entertainer, the motivator, the educator, Lecky Murray. And I'm back with another CHH. Today, at this time, I want to talk about features, CHH artists, and featuring. Because if you don't know a lot of Christian hip-hop artists, they make their bread and butter from other Christian hip-hop artists through featuring. If you don't know what featuring is, it's simple. Let's say Lucky Murray has a new hot song called Yes Sir. Got the video, look in the description below. But anyway, I was not talking about me. I'm just using me as an example. But anyway, if I was rudely interrupted by you. Anyway, just joking people. But let's say Lucky Murray got a hot song and like 10 to 12 other CHH artists like, yo, bro, like I wanna work. You say, yo, DM me and I send you the information. So the feature, it could be from free to whatever the artist wanna charge from. And a lot of people are hitting certain big name artists up for features. And Roy Tosh, if you don't know, Roy Tosh does has a name in Christian pop. Interviewed him, what was it, last Thursday or Friday, I believe. Can't remember. But he talked about this tweet. And I thought about, hey, this should be a topic. And it is. So Roy Tosh had a few tweets to let some people know, hey, look. You want to do this uh this these featuring thing you want to hit me up or you want to you know just features i got a few tips so it's a good bit of tweets stick by me i'll read them give you my quick opinion and i want you the people to tell me exactly what you think but well, roy Taj comes off and he says a few tips off the top regarding features treat the people you are reaching out to like people that sounds simple but seriously the art and stepping stones for your career. They are image bearers. And then he came back and said, put love, loving others before doing business for others. His commandments should guide the way we treat others, especially when asking someone for a favor slash feature. And he said, kill all sense of entitlement. If an artist says no, don't, doesn't respond, etc. There's something in your heart against them. That's a huge red flag that you need to get before the father in heaven and deal with it. Hashtag just saying. He said, don't spam people. Sending consent links of your consistent links of your stuff is not the way to get your music out nor get features. Trust God's timing more than your spamming. If he wants you to have someone on your album, well, he not do it. And he says that artists go through many things a year, from tours to families to church to life. You have no idea what their schedule is like. Put yourself in their shoes to the best of your ability. If they can't fit, then trust God and reach out to someone else. Value relationships over getting whatever it is you want. This goes back to loving others. Of course, there are business type relationships, but even then, do your best to love them when in contact throughout the process. He said, expect to pay a feature fee. Artists do it for a living most of the time. Will you want to arrive to work, work hard, and not get a paycheck? Be generous, save money for features, and approach it with humility. Since I found the best way to get features is letting it happen organically and through relationships. Whether you know the artist directly or some you know has a good relationship with them and reaches out on your behalf. He says at the end of the day, features isn't going to make or break you. You need to do what God has asked of you regardless. Grind, create your own lane, be who he has asked you to be. Features will come eventually as he sees fit. Grind and trust he says be professional when reaching out regarding a feature don't just say yo how much your features bro how much for a feature bro it doesn't work like that unless you maybe got mad bank for a feature and the artist is trying to feed his family ha 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 so i'm gonna start right there i know it's been a uh it's a huge slot that he talked about but he, he made some good points and i think a lot of times people especially like CHH artists that are in the lower tiers, they look at the bigger artists like, hey, look, it's a stepping stone. Like, yo, I see Roy Tosh. Let me do a feature with him. His fans is going to instantly jump on me, and I'm going to instantly have the same success as Roy Tosh. And the more I'm grinding, the more I'm realizing that, hey, look, man, artists are, are, are not perfect people. You know, it's a few features that I wanted that I didn't get response back. Hey, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go on Fiverr. 
and I'm get these features. But I don't have nothing bad to say about these certain artists because hey, look, sometimes life is busy. But will I ever reach out to these artists for a feature again? Probably not. But I think it's two sides to the every story. But I just feel like this: if you want to do features, if you want to, if you want to get a feature, you have to treat this like a business, man. People don't want to be harassed because of what they do. Like like Roy Tosh said, man, they got a family, they got stuff that's going on. Don't take it personal; it's business. You know, keep moving. And in God's time, it, it may happen, it may not. So, I like what Roy Tosh is saying. I think he said the truth. He obviously was on a Twitter rant because a lot of people probably hit him up for tw- uh, uh, features and he have not responded back to him. And he and they probably felt salty about it. But I want you, the people, to tell me exactly what you think about this, man. I know it's a long tweet. Do you think Roy Tosh is right? Do you think that people should be more professional? Do you think that that's what we're lacking in Christian hip hop? The fact that, hey, look, because we're so small, people think that, yo, let me reach out to such and such because such and such ain't really that busy. I don't know. I'm just the man. I'm just giving you the news. But uh, let me know what you're thinking. Again, it's the entertainer, the motivator, the educator, and please don't forget all three. Lucky Murray back with another CHH today. And guys, Roy Tosh just went on a Twitter rant. It was last month, but hey, you know Christian and pop news. People don't really know about it. So I got to bring them back again and again and, and again. But uh, until next time, people.